On 14th August 1947, the last Viceroy of India, Lord Mountbatten, formally transferred power to the Constituent Assembly of Pakistan. Replying to the address of the Viceroy on the occasion, the Azam said, Your Excellency, I thank His Majesty the King on behalf of the Pakistan Constituent Assembly and myself for his precious message. I know great responsibilities lie ahead, and I naturally reciprocate these sentiments and we greatly appreciate his assurance of sympathy and support. And I hope that you will please communicate to His Majesty our assurance of goodwill and friendship of the British nation and him as the crown head of the British government. I thank Your Excellency for your expressions of goodwill and good wishes for the future of Pakistan. It will be our constant effort with for the welfare and well-being of all the communities in Pakistan. And I hope that everyone will be inspired by the idea of public service. And they will be in view for the spirit of cooperation. And will show their political and civic virtue which go to make a great nation. I want to thank you and the Mount Bethan for your kindness and good wishes. Yes, we are part of as friends. And I sincerely hope that we shall remain friends. I wish to say that we appreciate the spirit in which those in the government service at present and in the armed forces and others have so willingly and grudgingly volunteer themselves to visionaries to serve Pakistan. As servants of Pakistan, we shall make them happy. They will be treated equally with our nationality. The tolerance and goodwill, great Emperor Abbas showed to all non Muslims, is not a recent origin. It dates back. Thirteen centuries ago, when our prophet, not only by word, but by deed, treated the Jews and Christians handsomely after he had conquered them, he showed to them utmost tolerance and regard and respect for their faith and belief. All the history of Muslims, wherever they rule, is replete with their humane and great principles, and which should be followed and practiced by us. Finally, I thank you for your support <coughs> for Pakistan, and I assure you that we should not be wanting in friendly spirits with our neighbors and with all the nations.